So tutorial on using the Yorbell memory card programming software, latest version 3.00, can be run on both the Mac and Windows. If you have Win8, you'll probably need to download the latest Java runtime environment. This version of the software writes to and reads from the memory card. This uh, this tutorial will cover using the memory cards that were established before June of 2015, or as we call it, the old format. What you see here is a listing of what you'll find on the memory card when it first ships. On the right-hand side is a listing of all the sound files on the memory card. Left-hand side is how the sound files are arranged for the different seasons and the different inputs. Different seasons, you can have up to 24. Those can be uh, considered things like sound files for spring, sound files for summer, fall, Halloween, football season, Christmas, so on and so forth. First thing you want to do is uh, remove sound files that came with it. You attempt to remove one here that resides on one of the inputs. I'm going to throw an error. You cannot remove the sound card from the sound uh, from the uh, sound card until it has been removed from all instances of the uh, seasons and uh, inputs. So as you see, we have uh, some of the heroes here is on season one, input one. Input one is typically the uh, considered the front door. Input two is considered the side or rear door. To remove a sound file, select it. Remove it. Now we can delete the sound files in the list. And we have a blank card. Now we can add files. Okay. And for this season, input one. Going to add so you select the sound files you want and hit select sound files and it will move it over to season one input one move to input two now when there's only one sound file on an input every time the doorbell button is pressed in this instance the rear door that's all you're going to hear. In the instance of the front door, every time that button is pressed, first time you're going to hear this, second, third, and fourth. Now let's say you want to add uh, some more sound files for another occasion. Add a second occasion. And we're going to add some files. Now we go to season uh, two, input one. Input two. At this point, you can verify that the information, or you can actually, I'm sorry, uh, you can save the information to the memory card. And then you can uh, verify that uh, the information's there.
Now, if you uh, want to add a third season, you can also uh, reuse sound files. So as long as they're in the list, they can be selected in any season and any input. And again, you can save the changes. And you can also look to see that they've been saved. Now, the difference with the old format is that we highly recommend, after you've created seasons, saved changes, looked at the changes, you've done everything and you're completely happy with what you have, we recommend that you format the memory card before you do the final save. So here we go to the uh, drive that we have, format, we want to select fat, for the allocation size use the default. And hit start. As you can see now, formatting is complete. Close that out, bring up the program, and do the final save. That is a nutshell how you read the sound files from the memory card, delete the existing information, add sound files, move sound files around, add several seasons, and do a final save with the old format as, as before. The old format is before June of 2015.